Hey guys, well, it's a nice, bright, sunny day at the off-grade cottage. Perfect for tons of solar collection. I'm gonna put these four panels up on the bunkie. I'm just getting the railing system in place. Then I'm gonna haul them up on there. But for today, I'm testing something I have wanted to test for quite some time, but it took a while for the cells to arrive from China. So this is the, the bunky station I've set up right now. It's, the grow rod in here isn't connected at the moment. Um, I'm just kind of using it for testing at the moment. But what I'm really testing is this Dally 250 amp 4S BMS. So it's a 12 amp, or sorry, 12 volt, 250 amp BMS that I have sitting in this battery box just temporarily while I run some tests. Because what I want to do is see if this 250 amp BMS will take the amperage spikes of a saw and exactly how high amperage this Dally BMS can handle before it trips. Because although it's a 250 amp BMS, I'm expecting this saw to draw more than 250 amps at startup. And we'll see if it trips the BMS or not. So this is a old Magnum 2200 12 volt inverter. And I've got it connected up to a 250 amp breaker positive side and these are only 200 this is the weakest part here these are only 200 amp cables uh, or actually this is the only 200 amp cable everything else uh, should be capable of holding amperage up to oh, 400 amps I would think so I'm gonna start at the saw and we'll have a look at the readout here and see what the amperage spikes to and what the voltage drops to on these 280 amp hour cells lithium iron phosphate okay let's start the test now I wish I had a clamp meter handy so that I could test the actual inrush but for now we'll just have to rely on what this uh, magnum readout tells us. So what I'll do is I'm going to get my assistant to start up the saw for five seconds, take a five second break, start up for five seconds again, and we'll see uh, see what she looks like. All right, here we go in three, two, one. Okay, we'll wait for the... Uh... Okay, hit it again. And one more time. Ooh, I think I saw five. I think I might have saw over 500 amps there for a second. Everything's still cool. And the Dally BMS was able to handle that no problem. Surprisingly, actually. So there you have it. Um, from my limited testing here, these Dali 250 amp 12 volt BMSs can definitely handle surge currents of, well, we'll have to look at what the video shows in slow motion, but uh, I think I saw over 300 and maybe over 400 at times. So maybe I'll continue this test some other time with an actual clamp meter to measure, measure what the uh, maximum inrush current was. But for now, that's a good enough test for me. I'm going to start using it as a portable um, power station. Hook it up to this little hand truck. Cheers, guys.